Hello and welcome to Toto TCG. You are here with me, Matthew, and we are back here with another Pokemon video on the channel. So today we're going to be having a look at the last piece of team up for the set so far. Um, I say so far, so definitely hold on to that fact right there. Um, but we're going to be checking out the last of the theme decks. We've already checked out the Charizard one, or should I say Relentless Flame. That was the theme deck we had. Uh, this one in particular is called Torrential Cannon. And of course it does feature Blastoise. Pretty sweet. And we've got the Blastoise right there in that nice Shatter Hollow, which you can already see. Um, on the back as well, it sort of gives out what's going to be happening here in this deck. We've got a bit of Psyduck, a bit of Pidgeot going on. And then an overall look at what we've got there. So pretty cool. So I've already opened it up, ready to have a little look. So we'll slide this out. And they flip the coin the other way, which is always good to see. So we, we've got a bit of uh, suspense whilst we uh, open this up. Hopefully the coin doesn't flip itself over magically. It doesn't. So we'll put that just there for now. So we'll take our code out, which would give us everything for the theme deck. So if you are wanting to play maybe online, going to be pretty cool to use these. So there is the Blastoise right there. Nice sh Shatter Hollow effect. Love the Shatter Hollows. Really, really cool. Looks really nice. Wasn't a hollow in the set, neither was the Charizard, but they're making up for it like this. There's all the attacks there. The ability is pretty cool. Definitely going to be waiting for another card that's coming out in the next set. Already thinking about the next set. Um, which I think could be pretty cool for this. But there we go. Blastoise right there. So we'll put that with Wobbuffet back there. Take out our theme deck. Now we've, all got, we've already gone through several of these already. So we've got a little pamphlet here that goes through Team Up. We've got this awesome pamphlet where I don't, thi I don't think they've done this before. Which is... Uh, it basically goes over these two theme decks. So uh, either side is about the theme deck. So you've got one about the Charizard one and one about the Blastoise. It just goes over what sort of uh, cards are in here and how they can play together, which is really, really cool. Nice touch. We've got the team up thing here. And uh, what this is is basically a little pamphlet. Again, gives you the set list on the back and then on the front it describes what is actually in the set in terms of like team up cards, etc. Uh, then we've got this nice cardboard cutout area with our... Team Up GX right there, or Tag Team GX, as well as some nice damage counters and burn and poison all there. Pretty cool. And then lastly, we have got another playmat here, which we won't open this like too much, but on both sides, um, you've got a Charizard and you've also got a Blastoise. And then on the reverse side of that, this is like the playmat, on the reverse side of the playmat, you've got a load of information. We've opened this up and taken a quick look at it with the Charizard one, if you haven't already seen that. So definitely have a little look at that one. So let's pop that back on there. So we can uh, close this up and then hopefully put it back into the box if it would like to close. There we go, cool. Slide that in there. Okay, so the suspense has been uh, killing me to open this up. So let's have a little look at the coin. So let's get ready. Pokemon symbol there. And boom. Oh, wow. That is very nice. Very, very nice. Haven't seen this one at all before. But uh, that is looking pretty cool. I love the Shatter Hollow effect on that. Nice crystally blue effect going on there. Very, very cool. Very nice. That is very cool. Brilliant looking card there. Uh, that is not a card. That is a coin, Matthew. Well done. Good job. <clears throat> so... With the coin now out of the way, let's have a look at the cards that are in the deck right here. So, let's go through them. So we have probably about five water energies here. Okay, we've got four. Uh, we've got a Farfetch'd, we've got a Squirtle, we've got a Pidgeotto, we've got another Blastoise, we've got a water energy again. Pidgey, we've got a Copycat, water energy. Psyduck, Timer Ball, another water energy. Brock's Grit, Nest Ball, Farfetch'd. War Turtle, Water Energy, Pidgeot, Switch, Ooh, I love that went in the wrong wrong area, Switch, Water Energy, Golduck, How, Water Energy, Copycat, Water Energy again, Kukui, Psyduck, another energy, Squirtle, Cynthia, another energy, Pidgey, Fan Club, Whoop. another energy, Timer Ball, Golduck, Pidgeot, Switch, another energy. We got a How, Farfetched, another energy. Brock's Grit, 
Kukui, got another Water Energy, Pidgeot, Fan Club, Psyduck, Cynthia, another Energy, Pidgey, Wartortle, Energy, Squirtle, Nest Ball, and another Water Energy. Wow. So again, another 20 Water Energies in this one, and they all have that new effect on them, so that's pretty cool. We've got 20 right there, which is always really, really nice. Of course, we also got the Pokemon, and we got the Trainers as well. So let's just have a quick look at these. Bring this up a little bit right there. That'll do. Okay, so... Of course, we have got the Squirtle line, which is obviously very important. We got the Pidgey line as well, so we got Collect for a few cards. We've got a Psyduck here for a bit of headache. Pidgey up there for airmail. Once during your turn, you may look at the top uh, two cards of your deck and put one of them in your hand, put the other one to the bottom of your deck. Not bad to sort of get, get through your deck quickly. Far fetched again for another draw action there. We got a Pidgey up there as well. Pretty cool, like the artwork there. Golduck then. Pidgey, Squirtle, Psyduck, Golduck, Pidgeot, Wartortle, Farfetch, Psyduck, Pidgey, Blastoise. So there's two Blastoise in here, but it looks like there's a maybe a three. Let's have a little look. Maybe a three-two-two line. Or it might be a four. No, three-two-two. So it's the three-two-two of Squirtle there. I mean, I can just look at the back here and find out. Two, three, two, three, two, two, three. Yeah, it is. <laughs> there we go. Cool. So several cards there. Pretty, pretty cool. Okay, and then as for the trainer cards, not a bad selection either. We got Nest Ball, which is pretty cool. Cynthia, really nice for us, um, for obviously switching out the cards. Starting up card, pretty nice there. Kakui for that extra damage and also some more draw power. Brock Grit to return the uh, Pokemon and also energies back to the deck. How for more draw. Switch to get the Pokemon you don't want out of the active. Timer Ball for the evolutions. Another startup card, really good. Cynthia, copycat again, really nice strong card there. And again, just a few others there. Two copies of Copycat. Haha, <laughs> well, that's pretty cool. But yeah, overall, very, very nice indeed. Um, out of the two, which one do I kind of like? Um, I think the Bla the Blastoise is... It, it's, it's good. It's good. Um, but I think it's waiting for another card to come out in the next set, which I think will work very well with its baby self. Let's just put it that way. Um... <laughs> So that's definitely something that I'm going to be looking forward to. But I think overall, I think definitely the Charizard is the winner out of the theme deck. So if you want one of them, definitely go with Charizard. The, the, continu the yeah, that continuous Blaze Ball is very, very nice indeed. Getting the, en the energies on here, discarding them, you're going to be knocking out quite a lot of stuff, which is always very, very nice indeed. So yeah, overall, I definitely go with the Charizard. But if you're a fan of Blastoise, do not miss out on this one it is going to be good you're definitely going to be wanting these cards um so yeah definitely grab them while you can so yeah there we go that is the theme decks all done and for now that is team up done we still do have single blisters to open um unfortunately i still haven't been able to grab any at the moment i am trying and waiting to look for when they might be available i have one i literally have one so far uh, we've got a few other team up bits and pieces that should be on their way as well, so we'll be opening them soon enough. But, I mean, apart from that, I'm going to leave it here for this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video on the channel.